Yo, I look so skinny. <laughs> ah. I I don't even think I look. I am. I. Guys, like, I'm selling in Zamo. That's how bad it is. Yo, my mom's sickness was not. My mom's hospital stay was not a joke. Like that girl being sick was not a joke. Like I lost so much weight. I got on the scale. Actually, what is wrong? Hi guys. Um, welcome back. I think I'm saying welcome back because I just got back. Literally, I got back. Like I'm still fully dressed. I got back. The first thing I did was switch on my laptop and i'm uploading a vlog i'm currently uploading um a vlog from three weeks ago yo it's taking yeah i'm currently uploading a vlog from yo the previous sorry let me put you back from the previous week oh i love this stand so much you guys are gonna see the stand on the vlog and i'm also gonna link it down below i love it so much i bought a new um hey focus i bought a new um camera hand thingy so i'm busy watching because i can't watch and upload um what's this i can't watch and upload of i can't watch and upload i can't watch and upload a video on youtube yet so i'm watching Kay's vlog on my phone all right and she said welcome back it actually feels good to say welcome back to like a proper vlog like i've been gone for so long like i've been gone for so long guys this few couple of weeks actually from may june no from june july we august today's the today's the today's the 7th of august it has been the most craziest two months of my not my entire life because we've been through this roller coaster with my mom's sickness but it has been crazy okay crazy so I've been in Ellsbury back and forth. So I was doing something like one week in, one week out, one week in, one week out because I have work to do. I have this to do. I have hair campaign. I have this. I have this. So it was so wild. Sorry, let me put this back. <laughs> it was so wild, but my mom's finally out of hospital. I am finally back. So hi. Hello it feels amazing to be back it feels so amazing to be finally back to work i because this wasn't a break at all like i was just trying to get my life together trying to make sure my mom's okay i'm praying and hoping that she doesn't go back to hospital because i cannot do this i cannot do this and this is the last time and i'm here to tell you guys that my girl my babe is cancer free my girl my babe is cancer free that is that is so wild yo it's been the toughest two years guys wow it's been the toughest two years of our lives i'm not gonna lie to you it's been the toughest two years of our lives having to deal with this thing wow it's been crazy it's been so crazy and i've been open about it and i've shared it with you guys on my channel and i didn't i didn't want to cry but also i didn't want to not say that thank you thank you to my subscribers if i could show you i don't want to cry if i could show you my dms now get it together get it together okay get it together um if i could show you guys my dms you people don't know me dog like you don't have to you really don't have to it's you taking your time out to even think about somebody you don't know you get me it's so wild to me how people can actually do that. Actually, so wild. And I was reading some of the things to my mom. Like, your DMs and stuff. Like I can show you, like, it's a whole lot. Like, 
I miss you. I hope you're okay. I'm praying for my for your mom. This other lady, lady every day at 12 o'clock. What's her name? Let me tell you. Every day at 12 o'clock without fail. She sent me a VN of her praying. And I was just like, you really don't have to. But people actually do. It's so wild. Like, I absolutely hate taking videos of me crying. And it's not like I intentionally cry. But I'm just like, it just comes. Because it's so crazy. And um, her name is Dima Gato Nkele D. Every day without fail i think she started seeing after a week when i literally disappeared that's when she started sending the vms because she was like hey i was watching your vlogs i hope you're okay i hope your mom is okay i hope you're okay every day without fail she'd send a vn at 12 a.m praying for me praying for my mom and i'm just like you really don't have to but you actually did and that's just wild to me how people care to an extent where you taking your time guys you don't know how much that means to me like my subscribers, my darlings, my followers mean the world to me. If I could, I just, yo, I don't even know what I'd do. But from the bottom of my heart, like, I, I just got back and I'm just like, I have so much gratitude that I have so much support from people. People that I don't even know. People that I'll never meet. But they took time out to make sure that I'm okay. Do you get me? So, eternally grateful. And welcome back. We back. We we greater than ever. I've learned a lot these couple of few weeks. Hey, focus. There we go. Uh uh. I've learned. Do you want to work with me today or not? Let me know. I've learned a lot this couple of few weeks um, that I took time out, but let me do this because this girl clearly does not want to work with me, but sorry, but yeah, thank you guys so much. Thank you so much to my darlings. Eternally grateful. I love you guys with my whole heart. I am definitely planning on another um, luncheon. So we could see each other, we could speak, we could be in each other's presence, we could love on each other, we could share, we could do all of these things. And I definitely want my mom to be a part of it because she's also part and part of this part and parcel, sorry, of this channel. But yeah, welcome back. Welcome back to my channel. I don't even greet you properly. If you are new here, welcome home. This is a safe space. We cry here, we talk here, we laugh here, we do everything here. We, we, we don't discriminate, we learn it's the gays, the lesbians, the all of them, LGBTQ, every single thing you could possibly imagine. So, welcome. And let's start this vlog. Let's get, let's get this shit started, okay? Let's, let's, let's do this. I think I'm going to do some skincare because if okay when you guys watch this vlog you're gonna see that i went to go do my my chemical peel and my skin is doing so well um this part guys you have to understand that i have freckles let's start there i want to show you guys my freckles do you see them i definitely have freckles like i have freckles i can't even hide from the fact that i have freckles so my skin the texture is absolutely out of this world when you see it it's beautiful but sometimes I mistake my freckles for like actual spots. So my doctor was like, ma'am, this is freckles. And to an extent, you can't get rid of them. So, but I'm actually happy with how my skin is coming along. Um, we're doing a lot of work on it. And a lot of good things are happening. Guys, I am resonating so much with Kay's vlog because I was watching um, what she was saying that some things have rocked her. But also, we were just talking about something. And <laughs> this life is like a baller hey but one thing for sure is this is what i said and you guys will remember this if you've been following me and you are following me on twitter i said i'm not addressing anything eventually things play out and things played out tell you i left hey i went home i went home for like i was home for seven days i left these for seven days 
the way they are so crunchy gesana i'm just like wow i wake up and i say wow because i can't believe it oh ah oh. love it but anyway as i was saying i resonate with case vlog so much because so much good has happened and so much bad has happened but i'm just learning to take everything and appreciate everything that's happening currently and good things are coming good things a lot of good things are coming <laughs> and i'm very happy i'm very hopeful i had lost all hope when my mom was sick i had she wasn't sick actually it was just a complication in her surgery so yeah but i had lost all hope but some things some good things are happening some things or someone but we'll, we'll know we'll find out <laughs> we'll find out but that's why I, that's like i said i don't know if i want to do a skincare i'll show you guys what's happening oh and by the way let me just um what's happening what's happening i might be moving we need to go look for a new place um i need to rent this one out because i don't want to be here anymore um let me show you guys why i don't want to be here anymore. first of all my beauty room is getting smaller by the fucking second yeah and i can't handle it anymore let me show you so when you just enter okay by the way guys i just got back home i didn't even unpack like literally i didn't even unpack my bags with it my beauty room is getting so small like it's not it's getting so small it is small already guys this perfume collection is making and it's gonna grow let me tell you so when you just enter this is okay this is my beauty room right when you don't enter this is this is it and i can't handle it i can't because i want a flower wall but i will not be able to have a flower wall here because it's so small like this is my beauty room and this is my, and my shoes are getting a lot my bags are getting a lot i just need to just move out of this place i think if it were the fact that my beauty room was huge i'd be fine but it's very very small and another thing is i've realized that you can't have necessarily everything that you want especially in apartments in Joburg, right because you can oh i'm freaking loving this camera handheld thing you guys must buy it if you are if you're a youtuber you definitely need to buy this thing it is so light and so love it so you can't have everything with my previous place my kitchen was literally right in my sitting room and i'm just like there's no way i can do this and then i moved to a biggest place um my 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 sitting room area is big my dining room area is big my kitchen is huge everything is so spaced out the bedrooms are so tiny like the bedrooms are so tiny i think i could handle it if my bedroom was tiny but my beauty room was huge but my beauty room is not huge so it's just that's just another story and also life updates with busani um we may have to change plans about taking him i don't think it will be possible because okay the other reasons are personal but most the, the number one reason being that he's too attached to my mom he's too attached to my mom i feel like if i ever break that bond i would be such a shit person you get what i'm saying like my son was so so unsettled that he, he didn't see because i wouldn't take him to the hospital with me he hasn't seen my mom in, in more than a month like when my mom went back home yesterday he i've never seen I've, I've, I've never seen my son cry like that like he cried so much he cried so much he was sleeping he was sleeping at my mom's feet i was just like i can't break this bond and then as much as i'd want to create a relationship with him yes i can and yes i do have a relationship with him but it's not what he has with my mom and i have to come to the real to the realization and acceptance that it will never be like that but i know for a fact that i'm not abandoning him he has me as his mom you know what i'm saying so i think we may just have to do that and if you guys want an explanation that's that but also i was like i'm not gonna say anything but also i have been saying something so let me just let me just go all the way through with it so yeah shower and have myself the longest bath okay and just go shower but i want to have myself the longest bath and go shower what i want to take a bath but i hate sitting in the tub i hate it so much also my body starts to itch after a few seconds i can't stand being in water hot water unless it's it's a shower then yeah but anyway good things are coming good fucking things are coming i can't wait and we are going to be we we are going to be in a good space i i'm just praying every day that my mom gets better quicker so that my girl can be okay and go back to normal but yeah we're back baby
we are back baby and this week baby this week is going to be crazy okay this week is going to be mad i'm doing a lot of things i'm getting a tattoo i'm getting a few tattoos yo let me not even tell you but yeah today i just wanted to say thank you i'm filled with gratitude forever grateful for my subscribers followers my darlings my my everything i love you guys so much and let me like i said i'm not sure if i want to do skincare or maybe i'll just do skincare tomorrow but we'll see i'm kind of lazy i just want to shower and be in bed that's all but let me finish k's vlog and just wait for my vlog to upload as well but yeah good morning my dolls brand new week today's a monday trust you guys are well trust you guys are good um it's i think it's 10 o'clock already let me check the time it's 9 40 so it's 20 to 10 i'm about to leave the house i woke up early at like 4 a.m to do a video for this hair company these people are driving me insane the first flight out and go to china one by one because wow i've never worked with such a crazy demanding hair company and my thing is they just want to be different whereas i do things differently when it comes to my hair videos you get what i'm saying just just like ah at the scene at this point let me send you back your hair or let me pay you for the hair because i'm not about to do this with you guys like i'm tired i'm over it but anyway um we have an eventful day today i'm gonna go to this game i'm gonna go drop off my laundry i have to go see lifa for my tattoo i'll tell you guys about the tattoo story and then what else i have to go for a massage for a time massage since nobody's breaking my back might as well break it myself and what else yeah i'll just we'll just catch up along the way but that's that's what we're doing today but yeah let's not even waste any time i hope this dan can just be in the car but i'll let you guys know let's go to the car and let's drive now if you ever wondering about the way i'm feeling okay um i hope you guys can see me while well, there is a bit of light but anyway um so I'm getting a tattoo cover up, right? And the reason for the tattoo cover up is I have the same tattoo as Aliyah's face, right? I didn't know this until I got that tattoo because it's very stupid, get doll, for me to evidently go get Manje uma segmi welana. Yena uma njangu stop signs of my Does that make sense? But anyway, um, I fuck. But anyway, um, sorry. I have the same tattoo as Aaliyah's phrase, right? And I didn't know. And like I said, it would be very stupid for me to get the same tattoo as her because it's going to look like, ma'am, why are you copying the girl? I saw this, by the way, my hand tattoo. I saw this hand tattoo on Pinterest, right? And I was like, this is so beautiful. I want to get it. And I was like, I'm gonna get it, which I definitely did. And that was before I was even following Aaliyah's face. That was before I even knew about Aaliyah's face. Because I got this tattoo um in March the 21st, 2021. I think I found out about Aaliyah around about like both June, July, so right. Because I like I said, I saw this tattoo on Pinterest, right? And then I'm fine, thank you. And then um, so I saw someone make mention of it. Like someone first tagged me, she was like, There's a South African YouTuber who has a tattoo here, but one tag on Aliyah's thingy. And then I was like, Oh, who's this babe? That's when I started following her. Then I saw that tattoo, I was like, Shit. Then in September, I started doing my initial like cover up for me to start covering up the tattoo. Not even cover up, like for me to start because I wanted a whole, not a sleeve, by the way. I wanted a half sleeve. So a half sleeve as in Yokunala, where you see this thing, that's where it's gonna end, right? So that's when I started doing the whole tattoo thing and I was like, okay, then I have to cover this one up because I'm just like I'm not gonna be had or I'm not gonna be like because people are always tagging me, oh you have a little faces tattoo, you copying everything she does. I'm like, even our vlogs are so completely different, but okay, babe, go off. You know what I'm saying? So it's not like I don't watch Aliyah's face. She's amazing. I mean, American YouTubers are the freaking blueprint for all of us in the world. You get what I'm saying? So, um, I'm on my way now to where well, I'm going to start covering it up because I just don't want that whole thing. Like I said, it would be very stupid for me to get a tattoo as the same as her. And, like, it doesn't make sense at all. So, 
if you want a tattoo this is the first ever tattoo actually by the way that i got on pinterest like my other tattoos are very sentimental to me because i did them myself like i did the whole design myself especially this one um i told my my designer what i wanted for this one and then she just put everything together herself so this was actually very nice so i'm gonna go cover up these ones on my hands i'm not doing a lot i'm just gonna cover the biggest one which is this one which you can actually see that it's the same as hers and then add a few more lines to the other one so that it's completely different you get me so i don't want that thing of having people come for me for no reason for a tattoo i didn't know i just saw it on pinterest and i like it guys mean and especially my tattoos i never ever say oh okay um i need a tattoo for okay all of them are sentimental yes but if i wake up now and i see something that i like now i'm definitely gonna do it but i've learned my lesson with this one i'm not gonna take anything from pinterest anymore will i draw inspiration from it correct 110 percent but i won't take the exact same design because no way babe so yeah i'm also have um i'm also going to put my anyways do you guys see my camera it's mounted okay no it's not mounted sorry like the stand is doing what it has to do i'm just so mad that i can't put my my mic so it's definitely going to pick up background noise which i hope it doesn't and i have to whoo sorry i have to literally um bleep out the the the, the block out noise which is not a problem don't worry don't worry i'll bleep up the block out noise so after i drop off my clothes we are going to this game i need my contraceptives and i also need to buy a dye for my hair and then after that i'm gonna go see leafa also i need to wax baby i need to wax i haven't waxed this girl in a minute i need her to be falling off the bone because what is she doing being searched for i mean hide and seek is nice but i don't want my nigga searching for her I don't want my nigga searching for GME. So I need her to fall off the boat. But also, I don't know if I'm hungry. I have a headache. I smoked hardly yesterday. So, and then you want that's the problem. I'm gonna like one. So, I think I'm gonna pass by McDonald's, buy food so that I have it. I'm gonna buy my favorite food at McDonald's so that I have it on me. Eight me, I drive and I'm with the Angfun Loguni and Hashem, Niti Misele, or whatever you guys are driving. So, I'm gonna pass by McDonald's and buy food. I've been driving my mom's car. I don't even know where my indicators are anymore. Let me check. Oh, they're on the left. They're on the right. Sorry, my mom's car's indicators are on the left. Every time I go home, guys, I don't drive anymore. Like, I don't drive my car. Either I take Greyhound or I choose to fly. But the thing is, with flying now, it was gonna be difficult because there's no one that's gonna be able to fetch me from the airport because my mom was sick. But I spoke to her yesterday. My girl is fine. She's okay. She's okay ish. She's okay, but if let's go order food because I am starving. Hi, how are you? I'm fine, thanks. How are you, doll? Good, good. Can I please have the burra and hash brown stack with orange juice? Anything else? No, I'm okay, mama. Thank you. I remember somebody ordered this from McDonald's, nah? and then they tagged me. <laughs> They went to Instagram and they tagged me. And they said, this is so ugly. I don't know how EXO ordered this. And I, and I said, ma'am, first of all, I'm going to tell you what you ordered. I'm going to tell you what you ordered. I'm going to tell you what you ordered. Let me know. Hi. Thank you. So that was that. Guys, I just realized that I left this ice trope five days ago in my car. Because I remember I, w I was, what was I doing? Oh, I was going to throw stuff downstairs. And then I was drinking inside the house. And then I, I was in my car for something. I left it, I forgot it. Do you think it's going to be fine? Saying, saying, me. Hey! No, I need to be. Your phone, your phone, and who's the minister of, of transport? What's, what's his name again? Fit no for I feel in Balula Nin and Nimchel with a young man because I'm drinking and driving. Let's just cut. I took a sip. Is it the chicken of people? Wow, breakfast rainbow. So this is the one that I want, but I'm not sure if I should take one or two, but I remember the last time when I dyed my hair, I used one. So, 
I'm not sure because this is the color. It will see in front, but my hair is pink and I don't see pink hair here. Do you get me? Hey, but we'll see. The way it was so packed, they didn't even allow me to film. But also, why would you call the running? So, why aren't kids going to school? What's happening? Doing everything at once, guys. I'm at Leafa's um, studio, whatever. Okay, there's the lighting. There's the. So, I team now I'm stressing him because I don't know what I want. You said too many things at once. Give me breaks. Okay, there's how many things? The thing is, I don't know if I wanted to do it going down my neck or across. nothing like starting your period and you don't know like i literally when i was when leaf was done with my tattoo i went to the bathroom and my period has started like i am sorry okay let's we need to talk about this after wait let me navigate first after um but see this thing after the the yoni steaming i bought everything is just off my period came way earlier than it was supposed to and i'm not gonna say this happened when I would take morning afters. Like, I've never had my period come earlier than it was supposed to. I'm just like, mm-mm. This thing just threw everything off. So, I don't know. If you really want to do it, then you can do it. But I'm just suggesting that you don't do it. Because, wow. It's very, very bad. Which side am I going? Okay, I'm going up. So, I just feel like everything is off now. My period is earlier than it's supposed to be. I'm just like, nah, dog. This is not going to work for me. But... Yeah, I got my tattoos done. I got like two of them, three actually. Um, I was supposed to get four, but I was just leaf. I was supposed to do a cover up. Remember of this one, Leafa said he's not gonna do a cover up, but he's gonna. I don't know. He said he's gonna do something on top of it, and then he's gonna make it nicer. Blah blah. I said okay, cool, but we're not gonna have this thing again because I don't want it anymore. Like I said, like I don't want to be associated with me. <laughs> Hey guys, be back home. Um, I just want to quickly show you what I got. So I went to Mr. Price. I made a stop at Mr. Prezi because it's Sammy's birthday tomorrow, and I don't have any athleisure in my house or any sports clothes or whatever unless it's gym wear. So I got this cute uh bomber jacket, if you may. It's green. I don't know what's happening, guys, but if you realize lately, lately, oh lately, I wear a lot of green. I don't know what's happening. But yeah, that's that. And then I got some pins because I don't want to tie my hair with a tie. Because if I'm busy doing my hair and I tie it with... The, yo, guys, my body is on fire. Like, that massage was a lot. It was different from what I'm, I always get. But it was a lot. Anyway, I got um, these tank tops. I got three of them. Literally the same um, size. I got a super small in all of them, but different colors. So I got white, brown, and black. And these brown leggings. Um, this is my third pair of brown leggings. I already have like a million pair of um, black leggings. So I was like, uh, I don't need that. And then I got these ones. You guys remember? Um, I'm going to do the water method on them. So the water method is just me putting them in water, in hot water and then just dipping their hair in it. I've done this before, especially with my blonde hair. And it has worked. I'm definitely lazy to go strand by strand dyeing the hair so it's not gonna work i need to go throw these flowers out those ones in the box those ones in the box are very those flowers are just stupid because they get dead very easily see these ones are still alive those ones are good morning um it is tuesday morning um sorry it's tuesday morning i'm chilling in the car waiting for for Nana, she's a bit late because her helper did whatever, whatever. So, I'm here to do my nails, guys. It hasn't even been two weeks. Wait, wait, let me see. I'll tell you. Like, I just, I just, I'm just obsessed with doing my nails every other two weeks. 
that's just the way it is and that's just the way it's going to be okay i did my nails on the 30th of july today's the um, today's the 9th so i've had these nails for like nine days but i'm over them so i'm getting a fresh new set and uh it's sammy's birthday today happy birthday sammy happy birthday to you guys sammy is amazing like whenever i'm with her it's just laughs and laughs and laughs and laughs and laughs also guys somebody said so i was reading the comments on my previous vlog like do you have you have to understand that on that vlog i didn't do much because i wasn't going out and i was going home and come back so that vlog is basically lots of unboxing me plugging you guys on things and what else just us talking you get me i wafiga lumye sesi yeah now nah, you've been do you've been doing nothing but talking for an hour in this vlog you make me so sick she was just so mean i wanted to curse her out and then i said whoa hold up wait a minute what no doll i literally just looked at my hand like my new tattoo it said focus on the good and that's exactly what i'm gonna do I just blocked her and I kept it moving because you can't be coming here and mad at me guys it's not gonna always be flowers and roses and whatever and then another one comes and says why is your nose so big your nose is big doll this nose has been big for 28 fucking years and it's going to be big for the next 28 years until I feel die and I leave this your F hmm? every day today tomorrow together it's absa do you get me do you get MTN everywhere you go? There's no day. So if you have a problem, then hong, hong, hong. I don't know, babe, but usato e bona cause iyo guala la eba iyo guala iyo sha. Let's here to stay. There's nothing I can do. Well, I can. <laughs> There's something I can do, but I'm choosing not to because next thing in that I'm 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 addicted to surgery, of which is good because yaba nle malgan yam. So. Since you're all up in my business with your nose, you said things I went down and getting in Bumul. Naming for now, file in Bumble and parts la put over. So don't worry, don't worry for as long as you watch my vlogs, you do you want a limb boom lolly. Okay, let's just start there. But anyway, um, I'm waiting for Nana. I already ate. Guys, I'm shooting and I'm going to have a long time. I'm going to have a long time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Show me some. 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 Diamonds in my grill, you see me shining. 24s on that kite and when we ride. Now show me some. Show me some. Show me some. Show me some. Yeah. Don't worry, you. I told you, I'm going to buy another food. These are so cute, Nana. Are they? <laughs> 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 Nana, you're a clown. Let me tell you. <laughs> it's been a minute since you guys saw me in this element. But what a do, baby? Are you guys... <laughs> Yo, it's been a minute since I've been this girl. It's been a damn minute but anyway um i got home um i'm super late oh baby get into it get into her okay get it to her um i got home then i was late and it just fucked up my whole day but i want to do a drip check real quick um let me put you guys here will you be able to see me though Ish. i'm using my small thingy i'm using my small um what you call this? My small tripod. I'm not using the long one, but yo, Sana, if kung yeah drip check. Yo, it's not working. I need to put you guys even higher. Let me see if it's gonna work here. Yo, I I, I need my long stand. I definitely need my long stand. But um do I have to go put it now? Let's get into this face. 
I did one. I didn't do foundation today, guys. I just put concealers right through. And I'm just like, I'm happy. Listen, let me tell you, I'm happy with it. I'm obsessed. And that's that. Let me try standing here for drip check. But, yo, uh, uh, please, if there's no drip check today, I'll do drip check when we get to wherever we're going. Because there's actually no way that doll stand straight. My camera's not standing straight because it's not straight. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. There's a bit of drip check. Oh, okay. So I'm wearing these pants from, I don't remember. This is the two piece. I'm wearing this um, thingy from Mr. Mr. Price. I'm finally wearing these. I'm trying them out. Our Cindy, our Cindy, fuck. And then, and then I'm wearing my Fendi earrings. Create nothing. You get me. But um, yeah, that is today's trip check, and ish, I hope you guys see it. But yeah, I hope you love it. I am so excited because I haven't done my face in a minute. But you get me. So let's not even waste time. Let's not even play. Let's go straight to Sammy. Um, I told this one that can I please give Sammy these flowers because I'm leaving on Friday and it's pointless to be having these flowers here without me seeing them. Because also those ones, I didn't enjoy them because I wasn't here. So I'm going to take those and give them to Sammy. It's almost like he was like, okay, tell that I bought them. So Sammy's going to be happy that he bought them because Sammy knows him. But anyway, oh, my bag. I am carrying this bag. Um, we might go to the club later. So I'm definitely going to carry my other big bag so that I can put my jacket and my sneakers. I am not about to wear heels today. I am not about it. But get into this face. Get into this face. Okay. Let's not play. Let's go. You're the birthday so, girl. That's me, birthday girl. And today I'm taking over this vlog, <laughs> by the way. Hello. Welcome back to your hall. Is this my YouTube channel? Please put my video. Is this is your channel. <laughs> Hi guys, who's all you recycle? Love you lot, eh? <laughs> Oh, I'm sorry. 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 Oh, I'm sorry.
knows what she 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 kn
Okay. I'm good, things are okay. Two, is it? Korea. Korea. Yeah, that was in December. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So lots He's has changed up. since then. What uh, happened? I have a seven month old baby. Girl. You lying! <laughs> oh my god, congratulations! Yeah, so December 23rd is last time we met. Mm -hmm. By the time my wife was already in Korea. I'm still okay. I just need a little bit of work mm. done. Brown okay. again for me? I have to use my whole face, that's what I'm saying. You, you, you don't know how to use it anymore. <laughs> yeah, I don't. That's the thing, I don't know how to use yeah. it. Thank God. Because I'm yeah. just like, sorry. Oh, don't so we are done. I don't know if you guys can see that. I can't frown anymore. Can you guys see? It's not moving. <laughs> but yeah. Um, somebody in the elevator said it's not good. <laughs> <laughs> and he's not so that My skin is skinny, so I'm gonna raise you guys a bit higher. But my skin is doing what it has to do, and I am eternally grateful. Also, this lighting is cutting so pee. But anyway, hey babes, um, we are back from today's festivities, <laughs> and I got a bit of groceries. I wanted to show you what what I got. Apparently, you guys like it when I show you my grocery haul. <laughs> Love it, show you guys love everything. Oh my god. So, it's not like I went to go buy a whole store. I just added on the things that I feel like I don't have. Um, I bought milk. And we're not going to discuss the fact that this is full cream milk because I am not about to drink lactose free milk. That doesn't make sense when you're eating cereal as much as I eat cereal. So, I bought four of these. There's already like six, so I just added onto these. Let me tell you something, Ashley. Let's be honest. I went to spa to get. Um, I needed. Let me show you. I used Comfortex Ultra Slim Everyday Panty Liners. This is the ones that I use. This is the brand that I use. Absolutely love them. I can't stand panty liners that have wings because they scratch me on the sides. So these are the ones that I use. I love them so much. Comfortex. Get onto these. So I went to spa to buy Comfortex liners. My Puma with other things that I didn't need. Like, if you check, Lana, the six cartons of milk, why did I need to add four more? Why did I think I needed to add four more so that there's ten of them? I don't understand. Also, do you remember the amount of juices that I bought the last time? Why did I add these? So I added breakfast punch because I really like breakfast punch. And I added some liquid fruit. Also, I needed this lotion because I've realized this, guys. Let me tell you. Nah. The l -Oc, whatever. I can't pronounce it. I'll show you guys now. Wow. I need to go get myself some of that body lotion because it is amazing. Guys, you know when you get into the shower and your skin is just... Like, obviously, when... Okay, I wake up in the morning. Um, I shower and then I put it on. I go about my day and then I come back. I shower twice a day. I come back to shower because obviously it's at night. When I just get into the shower and the water just hits my skin, my skin feels like live. Yo, that lotion, that cream, whatever that is, is top two or not two. I'm going to come and show it to you guys so that you can take a screenshot of it if you want to buy it. But uh, also, I was scared because I was just like, I have eczema. What happens if I get a flare up? I haven't had a flare up. And thank God, I started using it when I was home because I was like, if I'm going to get a flare up, it's going to be a flare up at home and I'm not going to be, you know, I'm not going to be outside. So but also i'm taking pills for my eczema so there's that so i've been using it ever since i got it but i'm just like hmm i only want to use this on special occasions i don't care guys i don't care what anybody says one thing about me when i feel like i love something so much i don't want to use it all the time i only want to use it on special occasions so i do have um lotion but i just wanted to add more onto it so that if it finishes i don't have to go out i'm just gonna add um that tissue oil from Pip, the brownie one. I add it onto here and I just mix it together so it's extra, extra smooth. Also, this, I love it so much because you it, it gives you that smooth thing, but I just add more onto it. So, yeah. And then I got myself some Miami Acha. I've realized that Miami Acha doesn't make my armpits smell. Like other Achas, especially the ones, if you're from Nell Spray, yeah, the Acha team. The Acha team, yes, Malilan. That acha goes up so much. It's crazy how much that acha goes up. So I've I've stopped eating that one. And as much as it tastes amazing, it would make my I'd have it once. Cause I over my and I hate using Mitchum on my armpits because I feel like it always leaves residue. And whenever I wash the next day, I, it doesn't go off completely. I don't know what's happening with Mitchum, but no. So I definitely love Miami acha. Absolutely top two and R two, and it tastes amazing. 
and this is also what i went to spa to get i didn't get the dove ones they only had like little cotton pads i don't want those ones and then i got myself some aromat and i got um some conflicts so literally this is all i did today oh and i got my my botox i told you guys as you can see i can't move it again anymore i'd have to move my so yeah i don't want that line here and if you if you see but let's add like our mothers and stuff they have the lines here they have the lines here obviously when i get older i'll eventually leave them alone but right now prevention is better than cure okay let's just start there but i want to show you guys the l oxy mang 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 i'm gonna push right here because there's lighting this girl this girl her who is she is she from lagos is she from london no babe she is from i'll tell you where she's from she's from france okay she is not from lagos she's not from london but she is from france okay and she came to south africa to do what she needs to do and she's doing the absolute most i don't know how much is this um and i'm almost certain they have it at skins so screenshot if you may let me do that so that you can go buy her top two and not two what a baddie what a bad girl i love her so much <sighs> wow um let me ask this because what's all this again Tuta. what as in but yes I'm telling you, I'm so hungry. Wait, no, 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 Together, remember, I'm doing the water method. 
Where do I mix this thing in, friend? Are they mad? What are you doing? I'm dyeing my hair maroon. Which hair? The pink one. Remember I did a pink hair review? And I'm not about to sell that hair because who's going to buy pink hair? So you're going to make it maroon in the Yeah, and then, no, I'm going to make it maroon and then do a bob. Oh. But like, because it's body wave, I'm, I'm going to do a wavy bob. Oh, is it? Do you see, go to, what's her name? Miracle Watts. She recently did a bob on her channel. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so I really want to do that bob. I really liked it, so... Friend, I'm so lazy to do my new wig. I haven't done anything. So Friend, where's that wig self? So you don't want that wig now? Friend, yo, those lady hair people that I sent you, they charged me five hundred and fifty dollars. I said, wow. For what? For that for that thirty um six inches. But it's thirty inches though. Thirty six. Yes, thirty six. <coughs> Why? It's expensive. Friend, it's expensive. No, the inch. Oh. It yeah. makes sense. Mm. They charge how much? Five hundred and fifty five. That's like nine k, no? That's it's even more than it's even more expensive than my um <coughs> yeah it's even more expensive than my curly hair yo the way that hair is so high maintenance i don't want it please Anna. so your faved booked a house guys she's going on vacay i'm only joining her well not joining her but i'm only going to be kept on, on i want different scenery i just want to go out there and breathe and then breathe yes breathe breathe friend you know jobok is brown Okay yeah, guys, so I just mixed the water in a bucket. As you can see, it's a bit, I don't even know what the color is. I put hot water and a bit of cold water by the way. So now I'm about to dip in the wig and see how it looks like. Sure. And... <gasps> Yo, the way it died so quickly, friend. The way it died so quickly. Come see. Come quickly. I'm taking the stones. Like your ass. Like your ass. Mm -hmm. Ah. So quick. Mm -hmm. Now that is long. That pink is so bright. What the hell? I swear, friend, there's no other one in this type of thing. Chai. Everything inside. And let it chill for a bit. Yo, I wonder what the color is gonna be. I forgot to shake the hair. Let me tell you. If sorry, if it's not what if it's not what I want it to be, I'm definitely gonna use that because what's all this again? But very <laughs> long for the matte color and then you I really don't know what this color is, but it is gorgeous. Okay, it, it has yo. I don't know. Let me try. I don't know what this color is, but it's gorgeous. You guys will see it soon. So now I'm just gonna put my hair outside and let it air dry. I don't like drying my hair, and y'all will see it soon, guys. So Tupi just left, right? And I'm like. I removed my wig because I'm like, okay, let me chill. First of all, I look so cute. <laughs> I removed my wig because I'm like, okay, let me chill now. I'm even like, I'm like plucking my hair because I have a Benini event tomorrow. They literally just call me now to be like, hey, would you please come to the Benini event? I said, no, pee, babe. So I'm chilling now and I get a phone call that I have a delivery. And I'm like, who's it from? They're like, DHL. I said, ah! I ordered bags, by the way. I ordered bags from... Hey guys, what are you doing? I have an I want to tell you guys a backstory of my medical cause addiction. So the first time I got a job and I was working. Guys, why say I'm glowing, man? Yeah, I have a glow to me, but I run no butts. <laughs> but anyway, the first ever bag that I bought was a fake medical cause bag because I didn't know that it was fake. 
there's a store in Sunnyside, right, next to Rhapsodies. It's called Hip Hop Junction, something like that. They had the bag there. And I was like, this bag is so beautiful. And it was a Michael Kors bag. I was like, this bag is so beautiful. It was plain black. Just the emblem had a, my, an MK thing. Like, I was like, this bag is so beautiful. I think my love for like plain designer bags started from there, but that bag obviously was fake. So I bought my bag from there, only to discover like years later, obviously, now that I'm, you get me. Like that bag was actually fake because that bag was 300. <laughs> like Michael Kors is cheap, but not that cheap. Of like, I don't know if Michael Kors is a luxury brand personally, I don't know, but yeah. Oh. I've been wanting this bag for the longest time, and every time I want to buy it, it's finished. So, okay, I bought two bags. Don't you dare, don't you even dare judge me. I bought two bags. I bought this one. Ah! I think the one. Oh my god. <sighs> I think the one that I literally just want. Okay, let me start with this one. Because I don't remember how much it was. This one I think was 4000 Yeah, this one was 4 k So I already have a pink bag. But it's a light pink and I wanted a dark pink bag, right? So I went and got this girl. Let me show you. How pretty. How cute. This is, I remember because it's called a wild berry or wild cherry. How beautiful is this girl? Okay, let me just take everything out. Yeah, this one was 4000 Four thousand something, four point four point three, four point quite a lot, but it was four thousand something. So this is how she looks like inside. Let me just take these. Oh, she's so pretty. She's such a babe. Wow. This is what she looks like inside. Not much to it, but you get me. Yeah, that's how she looks like inside, and the color is out of this world, guys. And. Yo, sorry, but yo, I have to take out all of these things. Just wait, don't worry. I'm coming. Um, okay. Oh, so there's one way it's super, super long. Oh, and there's a short one. Stop baby. Oh, she's so pretty. Okay, let me just try and take this out. Yo, even if I can't take it out, it's fine. So there's a long one. Oh, okay, no, it's one small thing. But I thought, I thought, okay, let me tell you what I thought. I thought this one you can just put here, and the bag becomes like a short, cute bag, like this. You get me? You can carry it around like this. But only to realize that it's a belt, because it's a crossbody belt. That's what they call them. So you just put it right there, and then it goes down there. very hard oh and there we go yeah it's a cross body let me stand up to show you guys how cute i'm definitely carrying her tomorrow i'm going to a benini event tomorrow so that is how she looks like she is so cute what a girl what a babe what a stunner i'm looking at myself in the mirror right there what a girl she is so cute so if i want to make the straps longer i definitely can and the bag can be like you get me but this is who she is. So gorgeous. But the bag that I've been waiting for, the bag that we've been waiting for, the bag that the world has been waiting for is this girl. Guys, this girl looks like the Fendi. Um, what do you call that Fendi bag? I don't know what that Fendi bag is called, but I've been looking for, oh, this one was 11,000, um, 11,000 something, yeah, I'll check, but she was, she was 11,000, oh. <sighs> yeah, no ways, no ways, what a gorgeous girl, what a gorgeous girl, what a gorgeous girl girl 
I'm literally taking out everything because I want you to see her for who she is. I want you to know her for who she is. Okay? This is what I want you to know her for. For who and what she is. Okay? Wow. What a beautiful girl. Yo! What a beautiful girl. I never wear they put too much things, man. You're just like, can I just get it over and done with? Oh, okay. Nah, don't lie. Nah, don't lie. Don't don't come here and lie to my face, okay? Don't you dare come here and lie to my face. How incredibly gorgeous is this girl? How beautiful is this girl? Don't lie. Don't lie. Don't you dare lie. Okay, let's open inside. Um, obviously, this is the duffel bag that she's going to stay in. And then, obviously, papers. Some more papers. Hi, Bo! Back, what you say? The mama fun shampoo is speedy. And then, obviously, this bag. This thing that she used to carry. So, it's also a crossbody bag, but a bit bigger. So, yo, never so much. We do any unboxing today. Okay, here we go. And they, oh, wow, wow, what a beautiful bag! Wow, I can't believe it. I can't believe how gorgeous this bag is. Yo. And I'm on. So we're just gonna take this. Yo! Wow. Wow. I'm I'm wow. 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 I'm wow. 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 Hi <laughs> guys. Yo! No, you lying. Nah, you lying. You are lying. What a gorgeous bag. Like I said, this was 11,000. Wow, what a gorgeous bag. Wow. 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 I've, I've, I have designer bags, but wow. 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 Oh, <laughs> just wow. Wow. But anyway, yeah. This is who she is. She's incredibly beautiful. The gold detail, the cream. Uh, ish, my only problem is, guys, and this is the problem I also have with my coach bag. They don't have this thing. They don't have the, the what you call this? The, um, there's some steel thing that you, it's almost like legs, man, for your bag so that your bag doesn't get dirty. But also, this also teaches you not to put your bag on the damn floor. But wow, what a bag. What a gorgeous bag. I'm so shocked. Wow. 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 I'm just opening my mouth and saying wow at this point because wow. 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 Hey loves. Um weird story. I just woke up. So I finished the unboxing, remember? And then I was like, okay, I'm gonna continue the vlog tomorrow. But immediately after I finished unboxing, I just felt an enormous amount of nausea. And I don't know what's happening. And don't be weird and like, yeah, like I'm pregnant. Definitely not pregnant. But I just feel so sick and I, I can't taste anything. So I'm like, uh, uh, this is where I stopped the vlog. Also, I was editing now and I just saw that it's a bit long. So I'm going to end it here and start a brand new one tomorrow. So with that being said, thank you guys so much for watching. We back, baby. And I will see you on another one. This month of August is just a very hectic month for me because I'll be working. I'll be traveling. I'm just so happy. So 
I will see you guys on the next vlog. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I love you guys. Bye. I love the way you pop your top and how you lose your cool and how you look at me too. Say, wow.